Alright, we're back in Capel. This is a second video we're going to take real quick. I just want to show you the difference in... Um, this is a texture, a knockdown that was put on. This was, was rolled on. Um, not typically the way to do it, but what I want to point out is this is a drywall joint that shows up, goes around, had a bat around the light right there as well. As you see, you stand here, you can see right there that drywall joint. If you don't properly prep these ceilings before you scrape the popcorn, what happened here is the popcorn got scraped off and then a, a knockdown, type of knockdown, got put on. Um, it's a rather big one. It was rolled on, which isn't a usually an acceptable way to do it. But, uh, you know, it's, it's whatever somebody would want. You know, texture's kind of you know, see it in your mind and put it on, you can do it however. But you still want to take care of joints like these and not have these show up. So we're going to redo this ceiling uh, and the rest of the ceilings in the house that were done like this. We're going to match them with the knockdown texture you've seen on the previous video where Chet was spraying it. So we'll get this joint squared up to where once you get the texture on there, you shouldn't be able to see those areas. Um, th this was a trowel finish on this wall. You can see the lines where the paint's showing through. This still has to be sanded. You see we have some blade marks here, but now this is a smooth wall, so we've skimmed it out, so now we can put a texture on top of it. And we did that in the other rooms too. If you get to a spot where you're putting textures on top of textures, now you get one that's got a swirl, a crow's foot, a knockdown, and it just doesn't look very good. So anytime you get, you're gonna change textures, normally you're gonna to have to smooth them out and start fresh, skim coat the wall, apply the new texture, then prime and paint. That's the end of today's video. Uh, Text Pro Painters 817-962-0551. We'd love to come out and give you a quote if you're needing some work done. Thanks a lot and have a great day.